Hey, what's going on guys? It's Ivan again. Today I just wanted to talk to you about click magic and how it can benefit you uh, in terms of affiliate marketing. And later on, we will make some videos about how to integrate this with everything we've done so far. So in particular, click funnels. Um, but for today, I just wanted to show you. So let me start off with a question. If you guys are doing something, right? Um, maybe you're reading a book or you're studying something. How do you know whether what you know is enough and whether what you've studied is good enough? Well, you take a test, right? Which is something that happens in schools. Obviously, the teachers give you a test to determine whether what you know is, is enough or you should be learning more. So that's exactly what Click Magic is. It allows you to determine where you stand on your landing pages. It kind of gives you a test to see whether you're doing well or doing poorly. So it's not going to give you a grade. It's not going to tell you A plus for this great job, but it will give you a series of numbers, which you will have to interpret. And then you can kind of put the grade yourself and see what needs help, what needs adjustment. The good news is, is that if you fail here, it's not like failing on a test. Like there's no going back. There is going back here. All you do is you can just fix it and go back on the right track and test it again. Okay. Uh, so there's two really big benefits of click magic. Uh, which I'll go over. So I'll show you right now. So here I'm on my main page. I'm on my links page. So one, the first benefit is um, that you can mask your links. All right. So let me go back to our page where we tried to market this diabetes product. So here was the product. Promote, create. Look at this nasty link. This does not look pleasant. If you were to share this with someone, they'd probably know it was scam or right because it doesn't doesn't look that good so what you can do with click magic is you can actually mask that link so i'll paste it here for instance and this link already looks much better so for example i i typed in diabetes to make it more consistent with what our offer is about and now the new link is www.clmk ambition diabetes okay so that looks much prettier than this i mean Maybe one or two people will click on this link as opposed to zero for this one. So the obviously this link isn't the best as well, but you can make your own domain and integrate it with Click Magic so that it it corresponds more so to the offer. So for example, here I have two other different domains which correspond to the offers I'm working on. So you can make yours. So maybe we'll go on namecheap.com uh, and we'll type in diabetes.com see if that's available suppose it is available in that case we can integrate it to click magic and our new tracking link would be www.diabetes.com slash you know i can do whatever i want here and then my new link will say that www.diabetes.com looks much prettier than this it looks much more trustworthy okay it looks like an established website that you go to so the the other thing is that Sometimes this link is pretty common to people, um, and so is this one. So in terms of people that use Click Magic, this is the default fault, um, link for all of them. So this CLKMG, it's it's the default link for all of them. Which means that if people send out mass spam emails and the people to whom they send it to blacklisted them, that means you can't send those emails out either because it's blacklisted. They will not receive the emails. They will not read them. They'll not be able to open it because it's blacklisted. So ideally, we do want to make our own domain. Um, but that's that's the secondary benefit of Click Magic is that it allows you to do that. OK, so the two benefits are uh, looks much prettier and you can mask it so people actually open your emails. All right. So the second benefit of Click Magic is probably the most important one is that it allows you to track your progress. So you have here total clicks, unique clicks, filtered clicks, actions, action res um, conversion rate, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So you know how far people went in your funnel. Where should you fix something? Should should you fix something on your landing page? Are there not enough clicks on your landing page? Or should you fix your sales page? Maybe people look at your thank you page and they say, "This looks horrible." I'm not even going to click on the sales page. So that tells you something. Hey, maybe you should fix your thank you page, right? So if, if you if you click on any one of these, it's going to pull up and tell you what exactly it is. So here, you know, TC, total number of clicks, UC, unique number of clicks, stuff like that. You can make adjustments. In later videos, we'll, we'll, uh, we will go over how uh, to determine the exact traffic source, which is extremely useful. Um, 
And you know what, there's a lot of scammy websites out there that promise to advertise for you and they don't do squat. So you'll be able to test out which websites work, what method works, maybe uh, sending out emails to bloggers and asking them to send out your uh, special website works better than putting ads up on Google. You will know that and you'll be able to scale and mass produce that area as opposed to wasting money on something that doesn't work. Um, and this also allows you to test, of course, your A-B testing, your split testing, which we discussed in this video over here. Uh, in the video, we talked about how ClickMagic now or ClickFunnels now can only hold uh, two pages split tested at the same time. You can split test here, you know, as many as, I, I mean, I, I don't know, definitely more than four or five or six or seven, right? I haven't tried more than that, but you can do, you can do a ton of pages together. You can test them all out. Um, so yeah, I mean, that's about it. Uh, we'll delve deeper into this uh, in the next videos as we integrate everything together. Uh, but if you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, please leave them down below. Please subscribe and thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.